Samba has signed a contract with the American entertainment agency, Steel Wool Entertainment, and revealed her intentions to promote in the U.S. Amber is now listed on the agency's official website along with other artists such as Watsky, Anderson Pack, and Elijah Blake. While SM Entertainment will continue to manage her domestic activities, Steel Wool Entertainment will now actively manage the star's activities in the States. Steel Wool Entertainment CEO, Kevin Morrow, explained Amber's potential in the U.S. market in an interview with Forbes. Her message is the message of female empowerment right now. I think that's great. And Amber can sing, rap and dance. There are not a lot of people who can do all three and she can write. And she produces her own videos. She is one of those rare talents that can do just about everything. CEO, Kevin Morrow he also gave a heads up on the type of music Amber will be presenting in her US. Promotions. Ad choice is advertising in red invented by Teeds, her new music will be a mixture of everything. She'll be doing K-pop stuff, she's gonna be straight up rap, it's gonna be a little bit of everything. CEO Kevin Morrow Amber has also revealed what she has been up to recently in LA. Yeah, I'm always in the studio working on music and dancing. I'm training with a bunch of choreographers here in LA, who are really good friends of mine and, I'm, learning as much as I can and reflecting on the years I've been in the industry and what did I not have time, to work on. Because I was always busy working. Amber with deals for becoming an ambassador for Nike and L'Oreal's Redken brand, Amber has truly come into her own and fans are excited to see what she comes up with in her exciting new projects. Soul Metro clarifies that Subway ad ban will not apply to idle birthday signs.